I'm Brian and I'm gonna show you 10 Lowe's shopping secrets that you can use next time you go into Lowe's. Make sure you stick around until the end of the video because at the end I'm gonna show you 10 Home Depot shopping secrets. So the first one we're gonna dive into, this one can save you money, but there's two different types of clearance. This is the new lower price yellow tags versus the clearance yellow tags. So there's a difference, it's like a two-step process. The new lower price tags, as you can see, it's going to say new lower price, and then it's going to show the price, and then it's going to show the previous price before that. Now this is kind of the first step down in sales. It's a clearance tag, but it's probably going to go lower with different holidays like July 4th, President's Day, Christmas, Black Friday. A lot of times after it's marked down from new lower price, it'll go down to clearance now. I've heard from other comments that you can look at the cent, like if it's a one cent, if it ends in a one cent, then it's been reduced one week ago. And if it's Greater than that, it's, it goes by cent. If it's two, two weeks ago, three cents at the very end, three weeks ago, and so forth. But let me know if, if you all know anything about that. That's what I've heard. And a lot of times these straight clearance deals, they're going to be a lot better than the new lower price deals. Secret number two. This is the scratch and dent section for appliances. This is usually located on the very back wall behind the appliance area or the back aisle. You, we've got some microwaves back here. You'll notice they have some washer and dryer pedestals and then another microwave here. And just because the box is opened, a lot of times you're going to be finding a lot of savings 20% up, 10% up, and even above that, this is like $69, I think, for the pedestal, and it was quite a bit higher. And a lot of times these scratches are even on the side of the appliance or back, and you won't even see them as long as they'll be functional. All right, next up is number three, Lowe's bulk savings deals. A lot of times you'll be walking around the store and you'll see bulk saving signs. You don't have to be a contractor to take advantage of these. If you look here, this is on roofing shingles, and obviously you're gonna be buying a lot of roofing shingles. You can save hundreds of dollars. A lot of times you'll see them on caulk as well, hardware, screws, nails, things like that. If you're buying in bulk, you're gonna be saving quite a bit. Lowe's secret number four. You may know that Lowe's cuts wood for free, but they also cut a lot of other items. They cut shelving, piping, PVC, um, blinds. They cut blinds down to, if you have the specs that you need, you can bring those specs in and they can go ahead and cut those. And that way you don't have to mess around with that at home. One tip I would recommend for this, especially when you're cutting blinds, is to ask for someone who does it all the time. This is a tip I heard from an employee. They said, ask for the guy who cuts it all the time, instead of just asking you know, a rookie or something when they're understaffed you're gonna get a much cleaner cut and a better cut a lot of times. Because I hang a lot of wire shelving, I had to go in, so I had the measurements of the closet, the wire shelf I needed, a lot easier to do it there, and then bring, coming home and getting your cutters out and having to cut it at home. It's spring here at least, so when you're going to the outdoor section with plants, go ahead and check out the clearance plant area. They usually have a little rolling cart with clearance plants that a lot of them look just fine, I was looking around at the clearance plants here, and you can see some that are just, even the blooming part of the plant just kind of bent over too much. It almost just needed like a wooden dowel and a little bit of tie string, and it was fine. A lot of these plants, you can see the discount tier here. These plants are up to half off, so it's, it's great just to check them out. Why not? And also, I believe you can return plants up to one year. Someone had told me you can't do it on clearance plants, but you can do it on other plants. All right, guys, next up here we have the Lowe's price match. So what this is, is they have their lowest price guarantee. Home Depot does this as well. If you find a current lower price on an identical in-stock item from another local retailer, they'll match the price. Just show the website, add printout or photo to an associate so they can validate it. The lowest price guarantee item must be available from the competitor to ship to the customer's location. Just keep in mind, that the lowest price guarantee includes the price of the item plus the shipping or delivery cost. Because I thought they didn't price match on Amazon. They do. It says we price match items sold by Amazon, but not by a third party seller on Amazon. The next secret is appliance rebates. So this is something you may not have thought of necessarily, but if you're going to be buying a new appliance at Lowe's, 
just keep in mind that more than likely there's going to be a rebate from Lowe's. So what we can do here is we can go on the website here. I've already typed it in, but I just put rebates and it pops up. This says rebates on dishwashers. So this first one here, this says dynamic dry. This is an LG. Right here it says, oh, here we go. Right here it says rebates available. So we're going to click that and that brings up, we're just going to say residential and it says $600 in rebates. You can obviously check in store if there's appliance rebates, but you can also do it online, which is probably better just because you'd be able to see it before you go into the store if you're the type of person that feels pressured or things like that when you're picking things out. One more thing to keep in mind is that you should check with your utility company as well to see if there's a special rebate you would qualify for. A lot of times if you buy an energy saving appliance, you'll actually qualify for additional rebates on top of the manufacturer rebates. All right, so this is something that I really like. It's not really a secret, but it's not shown as much as it was maybe a decade ago from Lowe's. You can rent a pickup truck from Lowe's for $19 for an hour and a half. Now this is great because you can do this if you go in, you have to pick up some drywall, and for whatever reason, it's not going to fit the bed of your truck, or you don't have a truck, or you have to buy something that's not going to fit in your car or SUV, and you don't want to drive all the way back. What you can do is just for $19 for an hour and a half, and it's only $7 every 15 minutes after that, so it's not anything too crazy. You can go ahead and just rent a truck, and then just bring it back, and then drive your car that you left at Lowe's back home. So if you need to basically pick up supplies, bring it back to a project, a DIY project you're working on at home, you can do that. A four hour rental, if you want to sign up for that is $69. 24 hour rental, it goes up from there. I would, and one thing that they do mention here, it just says call your local Lowe's to make sure they have a truck. If you do plan ahead for this, maybe they'll, you call them and you'll say, hey, I'm on my way. Can you just pull this truck? I'll be there in 15, 20 minutes. A lot of times they'll say, yeah, sure, just give me your name or something. And keep in mind, when you do this, you're going to need your driver's license, proof of insurance, and a credit card. And to give thanks to service members, Lowe's has an everyday military discount, which is good for 10% off your whole purchase. Now, if you look here, it says verified military members, veterans, and their spouses. So they get the 10% off plus free Milo's reward silver key status. Now the benefits of silver key status, it says members receive free standard shipping and earn more points per dollar. Another nice thing with Lowe's is they do have veteran parking if you wanna use that. So they're, they, those are usually three or four spaces right near the entrance next to the handicap parking that you can park there just to walk on in if you are a veteran. And Lowe's secret number 10, this is the reduced price lumber. This is 50% off. And this is in the lumber section. It's just this cart, but it has a lot of nice lumber. It's apparently this is coal lumber, so it's scrap lumber or damaged, but this looks pretty good to me. You can use this for a project, a DIY project at home, or if you just need some of these lumber sheets. And these are going to be stamped with coal lumber on the side. And bonus item number one here, this is the back aisle of Lowe's. You may already know about this. It's savings up to 75% off. This just kind of reminds me of like a yard sale back here. You just can kind of go back here and see if there's any items you want or could use around the house for really clearance prices, true clearance prices. And right across from it here, if you need any countertops, these are some laminate countertops here. And these are clearance. You always want to check these back here because I mean, it's Formica, but it's $37, it was $149. So this is just another thing to check and keep an eye on back here. I really wanna thank you guys for watching this video. I'm gonna include some this next video, go ahead and check it out. It's 10 shopping secrets for Home Depot. Thanks so much, guys.